To be the best weekend warrior you can be, you need to educate yourself with the top five gaming news stories of the week. That's why I'm here, so let's do this. Number five, Nintendo has now sold over 200 million mainline Pokemon games. And if you throw in spin-off games, looking at you, Pokemon Snap, then that number goes up to 279 million copies. So here's the 20 more years of Pokemon games and more ridiculous Pokemon creatures like Chandelure. Seriously, that thing is just a chandelier. Number four, seemingly out of nowhere, Microsoft has revealed cross-network online play is coming to Xbox One. That means Xbox Live will, theoretically, allow people to play online games with users on PC and other consoles like PlayStation 4. Now the only game taking advantage of this new feature so far is Rocket League on Xbox One, and that has cross-network compatibility with PC, not PlayStation 4. But still, the possibility is real. Number three, the Gears of War 4 multiplayer beta is roadie running away next month. Microsoft and the Coalition have announced that the early access portion of the beta will start April 18th and go through the 24th. Afterward, the open beta will begin April 25th and end May 1st. This way, everybody gets an opportunity to chainsaw kill someone. Number two, The Division has become the biggest new game franchise ever. Ubisoft revealed that the online shooter generated $330 million after five days on sale, meaning the division broke Destiny's record of $325 million in the same time frame. And number one, Sony has finally unveiled the price tag and released window for PlayStation VR. The company's virtual reality headset for PlayStation 4 will cost $400 with a scheduled launch in October. So you've got six months to say goodbye to real life as well as your friends and family. There you have it. Our biggest news stories of the week. Don't forget to check out all of our Daily Fix episodes for more gaming news. Have a totally radical weekend, everybody.